starting to think maybe I just should have recorded in this position the entire LP so I wasn't on the right the whole time. Anyway, greetings and salutations. My name is Comic Fire, and let's get back to the, uh, now he's eighth day route. Well, we can convince people we aren't the enemy while turning them against the angels. However, we can't avoid fighting those who are following the angels' orders. In those cases, we should refrain from attacking and attempt to persuade them. What should humans think of the angels who order them to risk their lives without help? You're mostly correct. You see, as long as the angels are in the human world, they cannot use their full power. And without humans as their foot soldiers, the tables will be turned. Uh, what a pain. He's the overlord, yeah? I still think we should kill a couple so everybody gets it. Again, that is one method. Conquering humans will make them see the overlord's power. We both have their ups and downs. If we want people to follow us, we can't hurt them. Even if they attack us. But trying to beat everyone means we'll be fighting humans and angels. Now then, let us turn to the Overlord. To kill or not to kill. And now we're going down the Warlord path. No killing humans. You want us to attack only the angels, even if other humans attack us. Are you sure? Of course I am. Very well. I will abide by your decision. This stuff sounds more like you're a savior than an overlord. I'm down with it. He became the overlord so he could help people. Once we have foiled the angel's scheme and driven them from this world, it will be ours. Let's go. Yeah! So, do you guys still hate me? Hey, isn't that you who and Midori over there? What are they doing? Hey, you who... You're the one, right? That overlord the angel was talking about? Whoa! What's going on? Please save us! You're the only one who can! Save us! All you have to do to save us is die! Uh, yeah, the, the conviction in her voice. Please or the just lack die! Thereof. And we didn't even need to get physical. This is a good start. Let's move on. You zoom Dory, what do you think? <sighs> what? How can you still not like us? Uh. Uh, what's up, man? Your voice is as depressing as your stupid face. Who are you calling stupid? What? Oh, sorry. Guess I'm just so used to arguing with you, who? Is it just me, or is this route still exactly the same? Whatever. So, well, it's just that this is really heavy, you know? Hmm. Everyone wants us dead and all. Huh? That's nothing new. <laughs> Between the Overlord and the Angels, it's obvious who's in the right. His path to earn the cooperation of the humans. It will not be easy. <laughs> yes. Finish what you started. You are the Overlord, and we are at your command. Now, and forever. Ah, sorry. Now you're right. I can't let this get me down now. I'm not going to complain anymore. You've got it a lot tougher than me, after all. Let's do this together. Huh? Huh? Oh, it's Honda. It is, right? Hey, Mr. Honda! It's you. Yes, you could say so. At least for now. So, 
Why are you still in the lockdown? Well, I'm just gonna skip ahead until I find something different. Let's see if this fight's any different. Do you all understand what to do? Don't harm the demon tamers. We need them. Okay, yeah, this is gonna be a bit tougher. Now. <laughs> oh. Attack the Tamers? Jeez. Alright, I've decided I was gonna do the uh, Warlord route anyway. So I went through and I decided these are the parts I'd be willing to show. Anyway, Amane joined up because remember what she said. We're against God, the Shoman Kai is technically against God. So Amane joined us. No, Amane, it is true. You did join us. <laughs> you summoned demons to take over the <clears throat> world! Uh, I ain't so good with words, but let me try explaining this to you twits. Have we used any demons on you? Hell, I'd really like to. Keeping you numb nuts safe is a real pain. The only reason you're still alive is because he's keeping the demons back. Uh, that can't be true! It is true, everyone. We would all be dead had he not become the Overlord. I don't believe this crap! Show us some evidence! There is no evidence. Only the truth. So you can't prove anything? We're not trusting you! I expected that response. But there is nothing more we can do at the moment. It will take more time to persuade them. Let's not waste our breath now. If they get more worked up, we may end up having to kill them. Let's go. Very well. Hey, come back here! <gasps> oh man. Anyway, here's the new team. And by new team, I mean I've got Metatron on my side, baby. He's level I 89, and you have to fuse Remiel and Akazfiel to get him. And here's his stats and all that. I gave him Sama Rakarm, Deathbound, and Mabupu Dine. He comes with Victory Cry and Bloodwine, but I gave him Ice Repel and Anti-Elect to patch up his Ice and Electric weaknesses. And he comes completely immune to Physical, Fire, and Force, and he reflects Darkness to boot. Metatron is a really good demon. And I'm going through my uh, next New Game Plus, and let me tell you, I actually got like 24,000 damage on a early game enemy. It was pretty insane. Hmm? Hey, can you hear something? It's that voice from this morning. And it's Metatron. Oh dear. If thou wishest to prevent this, Overlord, thou must repent thy sins and surrender thy life. Only then will mankind avoid his judgment and continue to thrive. Man, there's that line of BS again. What? If we don't want to kill everybody on the planet, we've got to hand him over? Huh? Oh, because everyone's gonna try to kill the Overlord. Damn. Hang on. It can't be just us. Everyone else is at zero, too. Doesn't that mean we have to worry about the purging, too? Metatron and Remiel are both Observer Angels. I see. They plan to use God's Thunder. God's Thunder? Is that like the UEM field the government was going to use? There's no comparing them. Remiel is the observer and the one controlling God's Thunder. He has the authority to eradicate any demons that try to climb into the heavens. Cursed angels. 
They will destroy the world to prevent his awakening. Huh. It's like the UEM field cranked up to a million? Oh, this is getting way too heavy. I made a mistake. So this is why Remiel disappeared. What? Remiel? Remiel was working closely with humans up until now. They must truly be desperate. Huh. God's got his back to the wall, huh? He wants us dead, no matter what it takes. Hey! I found them! Over there! <coughs> Come on! Die so we can all be saved! Go away, Metatron. Dost thou hear, human who has become overlord? Thy life can save the entire human race. This is thy final warning. Decide. <clears throat> hey, we're surrounded. What are we gonna do? Call Ghostbusters. Please? This is the last chance to save us. You're the only one who can help us. Just give yourself up. Hold on. He doesn't have to die. You, Zoo. She was gonna answer you, you dumb bitch. Listen to me, everyone. I'll tell you the truth. The truth? Yes. The angels said the lockdown was supposed to end yesterday, but they never said they'd save us. The truth is, they were going to end the lockdown by killing everyone inside. No, that can't be. The lockdown itself was carried out by the SDF, right? Then, then the government was gonna kill us too? That can't be true. You... You're one of them, aren't you? You're trying to trick us! No, I'm not lying. Listen, I have someone here who can prove it. Who could it be? Izuna! Please listen, everyone. I am Captain Misaki Izuna of the government's special unit. Izuna, why are you... The special unit? Wait, I've seen you before. Many of you may recognize me. I was in command of the lockdown zone. The government has yet to explain anything to the people. They are keeping silent. This state of affairs is unacceptable. I declare my support of this young man. I am not acting as an agent of the government, but as my own person. What should we do? I mean, I guess we can hear what she has to say. Thank you. I was sent into the lockdown as part of a military operation. We had one week to deal with the situation, either by killing or stopping the demons. The government decided that a special step must be taken in case we ran out of time. They chose to use a special weapon that would kill all the demons and all the humans. Dun dun dun. What? Th that can't be. The government was going to kill us along with the demons? Yes. That was all part of the orders I received. No, let me rephrase that. It was conditions the angels forced on the government. The angels. The angels. Even our government. <clears throat> they really abandoned us? The demons massively overpowered us. I was prepared to die during the operation. But this young man reversed the situation, becoming the overlord and saving us. My squad reported that our operation was complete and that the lockdown should end. But... Then why hasn't it been lifted yet? I assume our government tried, but the barricades are still present. This is because the angels prevented us from doing so. <gasps> Say it ain't so. We kept our promise and did not use our special weapon. That's why we're still alive. However, the angels are pressuring us into continuing the lockdown. What? Are you serious? Then what? Damn. So we really owe our lives to this overlord kid. Yes. That's why I'm here. To clear their names. Hey, now that you mention it, when we attacked them before, they never fought back. If they're that strong, they could have killed us in an instant. <laughs> We're warlords, not despots. You're right. The angels tried to kill us for using forbidden power or something. And then these guys showed up and rescued us from the angels. He might be the overlord, but he's not using the demons for personal gain. It seems they understand now. Father, we did it. This is all thanks to you and your belief in humanity. Oh, hey, Midori. And to you too, Yuzu, for believing in him. 
You too, Yuzu. No, I'm no good. I ran away from him. I didn't stick with him. I wanted to make up for that. Huh? Yuzu, you're all red! Oh, you're embarrassed! Midori, when'd you get here? And I'm not embarrassed. That voice crack, though. Everyone knows you want to hop on that Royal Overlord D. You, you are the ones who left me. Oh yeah, the Shomen Kai split into two factions, sort of like uh, Team Plasma in fifth generation of Pokemon. We were wrong. We were blinded by desire and lost sight of what truly matters. The ones who supported Amane in the goals to kill God and the ones who just wanted to kill the Overlord for killing Belbereth. Is that all you're gonna say, dude? The Shomon Kai must explain the truth to those who do not yet know. We must make plain the cruel actions of the angels and clear the Overlord's name. Of course. I will gladly help you in any way. Also, if the angels begin purging the world of humans, you must protect those you can. I am asking you to risk your lives, but we must if it becomes necessary. I understand. If the angels attack, the Shomon Kai will protect the civilians. Hey! We're demon tamers too. We'll help you out. Yes! You're right! Running away won't change anything! Humans need to help each other! Captain Izuna here. Roger. Thank you for your cooperation. Listen, everyone! I've received a message from the other SDF soldiers. They've regrouped and are going to act for humanity. Not as tools of the government. Hell yeah. They're spreading the truth about the angels and the overlord all over the nation. They're going to begin a movement within the lockdown in support of the overlord. Whoa. What? Can this be real? The tables have turned. Ha <laughs> Woohoo. You did it. You reached out and touched the people's hearts. Yay. I've also received orders from Commander Fushimi. I'm reporting to duty under your command, overlord. <laughs> And yay, we get a useless party member. I hope a Metatron's not happy. <clears throat> Foolish humans. Demons rob thee of order and lead thy world into chaos. Do not rely on the power of evil or praise the Overlord's name. These are blasphemies against the Lord. Repent, humans. Step out of the shadow of chaos and into his light of order. Shut up, you dumbass angel. You just sat back and watched us die. Yeah, you're not gonna fool us again. You can't lie to us. We won't be fooled again. Yeah. How foolish to reject the Lord's compassion and slap away his hand. It okay. seems the angels have lost their patience. This is the final act. <laughs> we did indeed. It was a difficult path. Yeah. You did it, though. You're all incredible for going through everything you did. You didn't give up, and you saved a lot of people. That's why people believe in you. Now then, are you ready? Metatron, the voice of God, has said the world will be purged, the planet will be set aflame, in a war the scale of which has never been seen before. But now, all of humanity is with you. Luckily for us, the angels cannot exhibit their full power here in the human world. That gives us the advantage as long as we fight in this realm. 
Hold up just one moment. I realized just listening to Skype beeps wasn't... If we win here and move the battle to the demon or angel worlds, Earth will be at peace. Probably the best thing to be listening to. You were born human and took the power of the Bell Overlord. Expel the angels from our land. Hey, are we back together? Don't you get it? He's always considered you a part of the team. Ah, uh, thank you. Yay! Hey! No fair! Don't you forget about Magical Dolly now! And yay! Yeah, Midori's oh, back! What? With this team, we've got nothing to be afraid of. Huh. This coming from you, Otakuro? Otaku what? Now you're calling me that too? Such a loud <laughs> crowd. <laughs> well... It's okay for now. Let's take action. Give the order. All right. Yeah! And we get Yuzu and Midori back. Unfortunately, Midori's outclassed by Naoya, who's just the slightest bit faster. It must have been really tough fighting the angels and being chased by the demon tamers. And Yuzu is still totally outclassed by Amane. That, that, that strummed a heartstring there, let me tell you. But Yuzu's been working really hard, too, you know? She was really, really worried about you. So, what's going on between the two of you anyway? Are you an item? Oh, that sounds so, so spicy! That's what I want to hear! <laughs> it's nice to have this kind of conversation, talking and having fun together. I so want to get back to normal life. Let's do it, okay? Okay. <laughs> Hi, Midori. Hey, tell me something. Just what kind of angel is Metatron anyway? I'd be interested in hearing this as well. Could you explain? Can't you tell? He's big, silver, and he's got wings. That's not what she meant. Sounds like a Red Bull can. Like, what kind of being is he? Metatron is a descendant of Adam, formerly a human by the name of Enoch. He was loved by God and was taken into heaven to become an angel before his life ended. So, God turned him into an angel just like that? Uh, B.S. Very. Metatron is known as the Lesser Tetragrammaton, with power second only to God. What the? You mean only God's tougher than him? So we take him out and really we're not... Too far off from killing God. That is the case. Conversely, if we can defeat him, then only God stands in our way. Yes. I'm counting on you, Overlord of Bell. If we don't win, the human world has no future. Why, Lady Amane, welcome back. Good work, Azuma. How are preparations for the battle with the angels coming along? We are ready. However, those we're about to face will be stronger than any we've seen. Even so, the only ones who can fight them are the demon tamers with comps. I am aware. Our founder's goal was to free mankind from God. Let us overcome this. Everybody's behind us in this battle. It's really reassuring. Mm, excellent. Everyone except Jin and Haru. Well, are you ready? <laughs> How dependable. That's what makes you our king. Hey! Hmm? What's the matter, Atsura? There's a horde of angels heading toward Wayno. One of them's gigantic. So he has come. Metatron, the lesser deity. That angel's... You already know that. Is that so? When it looks like we can't afford to lose. Like you said, once we take Metatron down, God's next, huh? There's nothing to be afraid of. Everyone in the lockdown is behind us. Yeah. 
We believe in you. All of you, do your best. Please, Overlord of Bell, win for us. The thoughts of the people will give you strength and will surely help you overpower God. All right, I'm getting pumped up. Now, let's go. We shall take this world back from the angels. And anyway, let's go fight Metatron. <sighs> let's go. I'm not going to re-show the fight. I've already shown so the fight. So here we are. I'm level 99 now, though. The angels are gathering. It's like they're trying to make this world into heaven. And as you can see, Yuzu and Midori are replaced by those two Reaper angels from day 7. Huh. Cut the crap. I know I'll never see heaven anyway. Damn. We shall fulfill the ideal world that Father envisioned. We can't lose! This is for the future! For the sake of Japan and for all mankind, I will risk everything. Here he comes. Don't let your guard down. And I'll show you what happens after he's dead. Since, you know, otherwise it's exactly the same text. Yeah, you guys didn't do jack shit. He's summoning the four cardinal archangels here? Oh dear. Archangels? The four cardinal archangels are those that lead the army of God. That fool. Damn it. This ain't a joke. You bet you're... I shall kill you, by the way, you won by. Hi guys. Ha! <laughs> Hell yeah! We won, suckers. We did it. Bye bye, Death Clock. Huh. It wasn't that simple. He was really, really strong. I didn't think we'd win. <laughs> Pathetic, man. Hey, we won. <sighs> Glad we could do it for all the people who believed in us. Yeah, now Tokyo's not going to be attacked by angels anymore, right? So the Overlord's finally awoken and used his power to save mankind. We have witnessed the true awakening of the Overlord. Well done. Our battle for the human world has been victorious. We have rid this land of the angels, and they shall never return. Hooray! You did it. Master Azuma. Very well. Let us tend to the injured. Yes, indeed. This is Fushimi. Let me handle the cleanup. Oh, I have a message for the Overlord. Tell him thanks. Yeah. 
You're incredible! You actually did it! Yeah! Good job! Now we can finally... It's not over. The true battle has only begun. Uh-huh, but we just... We forced the angels out of the human world, but this is only the first battle to win. Metatron has returned to the heavens to prepare. His next attack will be in full force. The Overlord must now descend upon the demon world to raise an army and assault heaven. The demon world? He has to go there? He will be gone for a while. Say your farewells now. No. I'm going with him then. Impossible. Humans can't exist in the demon realm. Not even me. Understand, this is something that only the Overlord can do. And it is his fate. <gasps> you mean, he has to go by himself? I'll do my best. Don't worry. The comp acts as a gate between this world and the demon. I will be your mastermind. I swear my life upon it. That is why I built the server and created these altered comps. What? No way! That's the secret behind the comps? <laughs> Stupid. Oh, King. My father founded the Shomunkai to grant humans independence from God. He attempted to do so using Belbereth, but with your power of the Overlord, humans were able to free themselves from God. You have done so much. I thank you, and I wish you luck. I'll wait for you, so you'd better... Doodly do. The lockdown on the Yamanote Circle was lifted, and life in Tokyo returned to normal. People began to live their lives as if these events had never occurred. But the young man who became the Overlord of Bell was not seen among them. Hey, Yoo-Hoo! Sorry for being a little late. You! How dare you make a girl wait in this heat? You... Jerk, Suro! Jerk, Suro? Really? What? You got a problem with it? What? Ow! 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 Sorry! Sorry! The bank was crowded, that's all. But look, I'll buy you something. Anything! Just, ow, just stop it! Ooh, trying to bribe me, huh? You'd better have a lot of cash on you. Ah! Witch! Demon! <laughs> <sighs> anyway, have you seen Naoya recently? Did he tell you anything? Naoya? No... He spends all day sitting in front of the summoning server. He doesn't pay any attention to me. I'm so lonely, you who. Ah, uh, get away from me. It's hot enough already. And it's about to get hotter, baby. <laughs> oh, that sound. It's the comp. It's been a while. I'm sure you two are up to your usual idiotic chicanery. I figured that you would begin to wonder about him, so I'll tell you what's happened. The Overlord leads a legion of demons and has won his first battle versus the Heavenly Host. I didn't think he had the leadership skills. A fortunate miscalculation. The war goes better than expected. At this rate, he should return soon. Keep your spirits high and wait for him. Oh, and Atsuro, your momentary dream will soon come to an end. Too bad for you. He's coming back! I'm s Yeah, he's definitely been working hard. All we can do is wait for him, though. It's okay. I promised him that I would be waiting. I'm sure he's coming back. Well, yeah! <laughs> of course he is! Things just aren't the same without him. You're right. Hey! Hurry up and come back home! Hey, Atsuro, what was that thing now you said at the end of- Huh? What? You had a dream? And it's over? What's up? No, uh, nothing. Never mind. Oh, yeah! He wants you to do the body. The young human who became Overlord brought peace to the world, expelling God's forces. God acknowledged this young man's power and moved the battlefield to the Outer Plains. 
A month has passed since the Overlord disappeared into the demon world. People have already gone back to the lives they led prior to the lockdown. But no one can forget. That in the shadows, one young man is fighting against God's army. Another top screen, it's that cool picture of him looking like, mm, I don't care. And that's Nalia's eighth day route. Conquer your demon. Break your barricade. Let's survive.